Hey everyone, it's Ethan or Miss back again for another video today and welcome back to the channel ladies and gentlemen We are here again for yet another Funko video. We actually have a uh, Star Wars video today uh, Specifically a Mandalorian video today. Of course, there's only three pops in today's video nonetheless though um, Why is this not in? Nonetheless though um, I'm pretty happy and pretty excited about this one. So uh Let's get into it. We'll start off with my least favorite of the three. Uh, that doesn't mean they're bad or anything, but this is Cara Dune, uh, of course, from uh, both seasons of The Mandalorian. <sighs> yeah, that's dusty. <laughs> um, but uh, you know what? There's a sticker on it. I'm going to just start taking it off now because might as well. Either way, though, uh, this is actually a pretty cool pop, and I honestly feel bad for... Uh, the actor of uh, Cara Dune, I do not remember her name, but she was released not too long ago uh, due, to, due to some comments, I think, that was made in the past. And, uh, man, that just continues to happen, continues to haunt some people, unfortunately. So, uh, I believe there's a couple of Cara Dunes here, so uh, let's see. What the fuck? What? Oh my god. What? This Cara Dune is worth a hundred dollars? What? Oh my god. I had... I have literally never checked the price of this Cara Dune because I just never expected it to be expensive. Oh my god. This is my most expensive pop. Oh my god. This pop is $100. What the hell? Oh my god. I had no idea, man. That is incredible. <laughs> What the hell? I thought the most expensive video or most expensive pop in this video was gonna be the last one, but this Cara Dune is worth a hundred and one dollars. Oh my god. That is insane. I'm just gonna check the market well the market, the Funko market of other Cara Dunes. Oh my god, she is just incredibly expensive. What the hell? The one with her really big laser gun is worth $94, and then another one is worth $75, and that's the cheapest of the three. That is insane. To be fair, this is the only one from um, Season 2 by the looks of it, as far as I can see. That is insane. I never imagined for this pop to be so expensive. That is crazy. <laughs> That is my most expensive pop, and I did. I had no idea. That's insane. Oh my god. Okay, well, <laughs> let's move on to the next one. That totally, totally caught me off guard. Uh, this is the child. I uh, baby Grogu, of course. Very, very cute. You know that. You've seen a couple of them already. Uh, but yeah, I actually have most of this set now. Uh, I have three of the five here in the set. I have seen the Gamorrean Fighter and the Mithral. I'm not buying the Mithral, though, because I personally just do not care about it. Uh, I never liked the character, so... Man, I'm still so shook at how expensive that Cara Dune is. But, of course, this is also from Season 2. Let's see how much this uh, the child is worth. This child is worth $20, so... Um, yeah, not too bad at all. I cannot believe that, man. That is insane. I don't even want to touch it. <laughs> like, holy freight. That's insane. That's my only pop over $100, as far as I'm aware. That is crazy. That is insane. Well, <laughs> let's move on to the final pop of this video, which is the Mandalorian with a child with his jetpack, uh, which is a very, very cool pop. And actually, there's a little bit of a story to go with this pop as well. So, my works, I work at Superstore here in Moncton. My work just got some Funkos not too long ago. It was about, I don't know, maybe two months ago now. And this was actually some of the pops we got as well as this child. Uh, but 
we had gotten three of these Mandalorian, or sorry, we had gotten two of these Mandalorians, and one of my coworkers had dibs to one, and I had dibs the other, and then someone else that was with us at the time when we were looking through the boxes, we had to wait for them to actually get a price so we could buy them, but uh, once that other per or once those went up, that other person had taken the other pop, and of course my other coworker had already gotten the other one. So I lost out on the two of two, but then I went to Fredericton that week, I believe, or the next week. I was hanging out with Austin, and then thankfully I was able to uh, find this pop. And I know this one is worth quite a decent amount, but let's see. I haven't checked in a while. Okay, this has actually gone down a lot. Wow, okay. The last time I had checked this and when I got this pop, this pop was worth $63, and it's now only worth 24 uh, which is insane. Um, I'm surprised. I don't know why. To be fair, I don't know why it was so expensive. Maybe because it was so scarce. But I actually saw some of these at uh, Showcase the other day. And they have a couple of the Grogu's as well. But this is one of my favorite pops ever. And this one will be going back here, I think. Um, but uh, yeah, I absolutely love this pop. It is very, very cool. And yeah, I mean, the price of it has gone down quite a bit, and I'm pretty sure the price of this child also went down quite a bit, because I'm pretty sure, last time I checked, I believe this child was still, was right around $30, and like I said, last time I checked, this Mando was worth around $60, and I had never checked that Cara Dune, but it's worth $100. That is insane. That just blew my mind. I had no idea, man. <laughs> Well, nonetheless, uh, that will be the end of today's video, guys. Let me know if you have any of these pops, especially that Cara Dune. But uh, thank you guys all so much for watching. Hope you did enjoy, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.